Wormholes. Is this real or junk science? In this video, we are going to discuss wormholes, what they are, their use in science fiction, their potential for interstellar travel, and how scientists plan to search for them in the universe. So, what is a wormhole? Imagine, if you would, a mountain, and there are villagers on both sides of the mountain. If an individual in one village wanted to visit a friend in the other village, he would have to climb the mountain to get to the other side. Or he could drill a tunnel through the mountain and reduce the travel time by orders of magnitude. Similarly, a wormhole is a tunnel connecting two distant points of space-time such that time of travel from one point to another is significantly reduced. Thus, in theory, wormholes could connect distant locations in the same galaxy or across galaxies or connect separate universes. The concept of a wormhole is a very popular feature in science fiction entertainment. It is integrated in the plot lines of Star Trek Deep Space Nine, where a wormhole is used to connect to the Gamma Quadrant, which is located on the other side of the galaxy. We also see wormholes being used as activated stargates, allowing for instantaneous travel between two worlds or galaxies in the Stargate franchise. So, are wormholes based on a solid scientific foundation? The answer is yes. Believe it or not, wormholes are a mathematical construct deriving directly from the work of Albert Einstein. Schwarzschild provided an exact solution to Einstein's theory of general relativity that includes provision for a wormhole. This wormhole is thought to connect two universes. Different solutions to Einstein's equations led to different types of wormholes. Some wormholes are thought to be traversable, meaning that they can be crossed from both sides, while others are not. Whether a wormhole is stable enough to allow humans or materials to travel from one location to another is currently being debated by scientists. Some argue that the middle of wormholes would capsize or collapse under its own gravity. Others have postulated that negative energy, a form of exotic matter, is needed to stabilize wormholes. This is an area of active research. To date, no one has found physical evidence of the existence of a wormhole. It is all theory at this point. So, how do scientists plan to find wormholes if they indeed do exist? Scientists plan to find wormholes with the use of LIGO, the Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory. When massive objects like black holes collide, they send gravitational waves through space-time. Scientists also think that when wormholes collide, gravitational waves will be generated. However, the manner in which these gravitational waves fade away will be different from those of colliding black holes. The fading away of gravitational waves is known as the ring down. It is thought that the ring down of colliding black holes will go away faster, resulting in silence, because black holes consume everything, while the ring down of colliding wormholes will display an echo after the silence. Link in the description below. However, it must be noted that the sensitivity of LIGO is not at the point where it can detect gravitational waves from colliding wormholes at this time. With upgrades in progress, it is estimated that LIGO will acquire the capability to detect wormholes within 10 years. Thanks for watching. Cheers!